morning, church family. Good morning to you. How are you doing? Are you blessed? Are you healed? Are you free? Are you saved? Ooh, <laughs> brothers and sisters in Christ, I know you're saved out there. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Amen. At least I hope you are. Yes. Mm, listen, I'm going to I'm gonna reach out to the one right now. Listen, I know there's somebody probably uh, scrolling through their phone. You're looking for something. You're looking for God, but you don't. Yes. But you don't know how to find him. Listen, I'm going to tell you it's so easy. Listen, if you don't know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, then you're not saved. And let me tell you how easy it is to get saved. And that is to believe in your heart yes. that Jesus Christ died on the cross for the forgiveness of your sins. Yes, amen. That on the third day, God rose him from the dead so that you could have eternal life with him in heaven. Yes. Mm, what a That's gift. Awesome. That's so awesome, isn't it? No, it is true. <laughs> Absolutely. So you believe in your heart. You speak this with your mouth and you say, Lord Jesus, my life is a mess. Yeah. I need you to be my Lord and Savior. Yeah. Will you do that? Jesus will step into your life. He'll, 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 he'll come right on the inside of you. Yes. Right on? Listen, he will step into your life and your life will never be the same. Yes. All right. Yeah. Listen, you, and you can call yourself saved once you've done that, that you've received Jesus as your Lord and Savior. And he will change your life forever. And I mean forever. Yes. Amen. He will. That's right. Changed our lives. Oh, yeah. man. You'll never go yeah. back to your old That's life. Right. I guarantee it. You'll look back at that and say, "Woo! what was I doing? That's right. What was I thinking? Yes. Well, listen, God's got a plan for you. Yeah. And listen, it's not wallowing around in the mud. That's right. But his plan, his plan is, is is perfect for you. That's right. Amen. 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 I'm thanking God for His Word. Yes. In this opportunity, I call it. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm, we're blessed to That's share right. this we with sure you. We sure are. Thank you, Pastor. Yeah, <laughs> blessed to share it with God's yes. people. That yeah, thanking Pastor also right. for the assignment. Yes. Uh, for we are blessed and honored to do it. That's right. Amen. Amen. Thinking of, what am I missing? Well, I'm yes. just, I just want to say, too, you know, Steve, that anybody out there that doesn't have a good church, oh, you, know, to, yes. you are scrolling through, come check out Resurrection Life Church. We have an awesome pastor, a great leadership there. Um, it's just a, it's a loving, friendly. Absolutely. Yes, loving church. That's right. They'll take you in and love on you. And, absolutely. Yes, absolutely. Listen, you may not... You may not want to go to a church building. You can also check it out online That's right, on you your can. devices That's right. during these times. Yeah, now, listen. If, yeah, and if you do, give us a call. We're oh. there on Tuesday, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Yes. Um, give us a call. Amen. Especially yeah. if you, yeah. especially if you receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. That's right. We want Let to hear about know. it. Yes, we want to know. Amen. Yeah, we want to know. Let somebody know about That's it. That's right. I want to say this about Resurrection Life Church. It's the perfect church for imperfect people right. like us. That's right. Amen. <laughs> we, Amen. Amen. Yeah, nobody's perfect. That's right. You know, they also have, you know, eventually down the road, too, they have life groups, things that you can get connected with people. Right. It's like a to get connected with that family atmosphere. Absolutely. Make new friends. Oh, yes. Yeah, it's, it's, it's very, it's cool. It's a cool church. It's an we awesome love it. Thing. Amen. Yeah, we love the people there. So Sunday morning, yes. 11 o'clock? Yep. 11 o'clock on Sunday, Sunday mornings. Morning. 7 o'clock on Wednesday Wednesdays. Nights. Yes. Yep. So listen, check it out. Amen. 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 What do you have for us this morning, my love? Growing in stages, people of God. Mm. Mm -mm. And the text is 1 John 2, 12 through 14. Do you want me to read that, Steve, or do you want me to? Oh, I got that, love. Okay. Okay, okay right. John's writing... Writing to the church, he says, I write to you, little children, because your sins are forgiven mm -hmm. you for his name's sake. I write to you, fathers, because you have known him who is from the beginning. I write to you, young men, because mm -hmm. you have overcome the wicked one. Yes. I write to you, little children, because you have known the father. Yes. I write to you, fathers, <laughs> and because you have known him who is from the beginning. I have written to you, young men. Because you are strong, and the word of God abides in you. That's right. Amen. And you have overcome the wicked That's one. That's right. You have overcome. Amen. But what John was addressing here was different people 
um, different different stages. Yeah, different stages in people's lives. Their their spiritual growth. He wasn't talking about their physical age. Come on. But they were talking about his their spiritual um, their spiritual growth. Yes. And he was encouraging them to grow spiritually because of the temptations in the world. And what are those temptations? Um, people of God, and that is the lust of the flesh, the pride of life, the lust of the eyes, and the lust of the eyes. Right and on. listen, and he wanted us to grow in the love of the Father because if you don't love, then you don't know the Father. That's right. And the Father's not in you. Right. Am I right? Am That's I right. right about That's that? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So if you have, if you love well, the world, well, meaning if you love the world, yeah. I should, I did, I'm excuse That's cool. me, people of God. If you love the, the world, world and the things in the world, yes. and the love of the Father it's, it's is not, not in, in you. you. Listen, we got to, we got to take a stand. You got to yes. draw a line in the sand. And listen, who are you going to choose? Well, listen. As for That's me and right. my house, we're going to serve the Lord. We're going to serve the Lord. That's Amen. right. Amen. You have to make a choice. And it's certainly not the world, and especially mm -hmm. the world that we live in today. Amen. Listen, I like to put things in perspective, all right, mm -hmm. in two boxes. I guess I was thinking of this today. Can yeah. I? Two boxes. I got one box where everything's important goes in that box. Mm -hmm. My. My relationship with God, all right? My walk with God, mm -hmm. my wife, my kids. Everything that's important to me like that, mm -hmm. they go in one box. Everything else goes in the other box because nothing, nothing else is more important than God and my wife and our kids. Amen. 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 So you got you to gotta compartmentalize, if you yeah. will. <laughs> <laughs> I was practicing that word earlier. Listen. Draw a line in the sand. Make a choice. Yes, make a choice. Are you going to grow in the things of God? Right. You can't stay in. You can't stay on the milk. That's right. That's what the scriptures really talk about. That's right. The milk and growing from infant to adulthood. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So when we're babes, yeah. we need the milk. That's right. I remember when I was first born again, I needed the milk of the yeah. word. That's and right. as I grew. You needed the meat of the word. Then I needed the meat <laughs> of the word. Amen. Yeah. Now listen, and I still need the meat That's right. of the word. C yeah. Continually feeding. On you it. know, once you get that relationship to Steve, I think too, then is the, is once you become that adult. Yeah. In the word of God, that we then we walk by faith and not by sight. Absolutely. You know. That's when. Yeah. yeah. That's exactly it. Yeah. That's and when yeah, you start walking so cool. by faith. Yes. That's, that's when you start stepping yeah. out of the boat, like that's Peter right. did. That's right. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Mm -hmm. So we so we know that our relationship with God has to grow. It has to. Then he becomes what? Our friend. Our friend. Amen. And then what? Then we have a friend. <laughs> that's right. Then we have a friend in Jesus. That's right. We have a friend in Jesus. <laughs> That's when we become mature. He becomes our friend. And yes. then we have a mission. Oh, man. As we develop that relationship with, in Christ as our friend. And what is that? That mission, you'll find that in, in Matthew 28, uh, verses 19, uh, 19 and 20. And that is to go and, and make, make disciples, disciples of all the nations. Yes. We're, that's what we're supposed to be doing. That's our mission, people. God, Amen. we are to develop others. Make disciples. Bring them into the kingdom. Amen. That's right. I know uh, part of the mission, mission statement at Resurrection Life is that. Yes. Disciples making Make disciples. disciples. Amen. That's right. Living the life that you were born Ooh. to live. Amen. Yes. Listen, you weren't born to wallow around right. in the in the mully grubs. Mm -hmm. You weren't born to, to you're, you're not a worm. Right. You're not. You're, you're one of God's you. kids That's and right. he loves you. That's right. And he, he wants to set you high upon That's a right. rock. Amen. That's right. To, to so that you can grow and heal. That's right. Amen. I'm going to ask this, people of God. Come are on. you growing? Amen. Are you growing from one level to the next level, level one to level to level two, level three, level four? Come on. Are we growing in those levels? Amen. In our spiritual growth, people of God, you have to ask yourself that. Absolutely. We can but, become stagnant. You have to be really careful of yes. that. Yes. Oh yeah, you got to be careful yes. of that. Yeah. You wanna, you don't wanna yeah. stay there in That's one right. in one spot. That's right. You don't. Listen, I know I've heard this before too. If you're not growing, you're dying. Yep. And I know that that's that's pretty strong, but that's it's the right. truth. 
And that's what we're here to share. The that's truth. right. Amen. That's right. The truth. So listen, ask yourself, are you growing? Are we look growing? Look at yourself in the mirror. That's right. You know, this, you're going to look at yourself yeah, anyhow. Yeah. Ask yourself this. Am I growing in God? Am I, Am I growing into the next level? Am I that mature Christian? Right on. Is God, a, is God my friend? Or mm, is our relationship is it, tight? That's right. Are we tight with God? Amen. Amen. Yeah. So listen, we're praying for you, right. each and every one of you. We love you. Yes, yes we do. And uh, we love sharing this word with you. Yeah. And listen. You know, this word, people of God, was... It was simple, but it's revelatory, don't you think? Oh, Steve? yes. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. get revelation I didn't upon mean to <laughs> That's all right. I'm used to it. I just to wanted, it. wanted to say that for some reason. That it's, <laughs> That's this cool. is, it's a simple word, but it's revelatory. Now listen, it's revelatory for somebody. That's right. Amen. Amen. And uh, so we love you. Yes. And we will see you tomorrow, tomorrow morning. morning. Peace. Peace.